Hello fans Arsenal, my name is Fabiano all are welcome, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss Arsenal first-hand news and leave your like to strengthen the channel. Arsenal are reportedly eyeing a swoop for Galatasaray centre-back Victor Nelson before the end of this transfer window, as per the transfer journalist Rudy Galetti. The 24-year-old has burst onto the scenes in recent times after displaying promising performances for the Turkish Giants last term, helping his side win the league title. Tottenham Hotspur previously expressed their interest in signing him to bolster their backline, but they never formalised their interest. Now, it appears Arsenal are planning to purchase him before Friday's deadline. Speaking to Givimsport, Galetti has reported that Arsenal are looking to sign a new defender to replace Jury and Timber following his serious knee issue and have prepared a short list of four players. The journalist further claims that Nelson is a name on the North London club's radar and he is climbing up on Mikel Arteta's wish list. Galetti also states that the Denmark international has a £21 million release clause included in his current contract so Arsenal can purchase him for an affordable price should they formalise their interest. Talking about the possible incoming moves after the injury of Jury and Timber, Arsenal are looking for a new centre-back. On their list is four different options. One of them is Victor Nelson. The Galatasaray defender has a release clause of €25 million, Euros, £21 million, pounds, and he's climbing position on Arsenal's short list, which has four different names. Leave your like on this video to keep up to date with everything that happens at Arsenal thanks. Continuing. Nelson is a talented player as he is quick comfortable playing out from the back, excellent in the air, good in defensive contributions, and also reads the game well. So, the Scandinavian could be a solid signing for Arsenal to bolster their defence if they opt to purchase him in this transfer window. However, it is going to be interesting to see whether Arsenal eventually decide to formalise their interest in signing the Denmark international over the coming days. Meanwhile, after a disappointing draw against Fulham last weekend, Arsenal will take on Manchester United in the Premier League next Sunday at the Emirates Stadium before going into the international break. The Gunners will be looking to bounce back immediately and return to the winning ways against the Red Devils. Put your opinion in the comments as it is very important for Arsenal I update you at any time with the latest news from Arsenal. Help the channel become a member.